Albert Einstein said, life is like riding a bicycle. So keep your balance, you must keep moving. Hi, my name is Juan Valencia, and I want to share with you how I completed the life challenge and won my first bike race. In addition to many lessons that I learned from my entire life. The University Classic is a forest stage race in four days in a run that takes place every year between July and August. At that time, I had been riding a bicycle for three years. What had started as a method to escape the traffic jam in public transport to the university had become a passion that had changed my life. I had completed in another small race before of one day with very little lessons. However, it was the first time I had to run a race of more than one day and I saw it as a challenge. I had to do my best and want to test myself. The first stage was 80 kilometers between La Cara and Sesquile, north of Bogota. This stage was flat at the beginning and it was going very well. However, 30 kilometers from the finish line, a person in front of me lost focus and missed off fall. I fell on the floor and scraped my arm and my knee. At that moment, that I fell on the floor, I see how everything happens in a long motion. I feel that a part of me resigns and want to stay on the floor. Things like, oh, next year it will be. But my heart takes a strange and tells me that we did not prepare the treasures to stay on the floor in the first stage. So I got up quickly and I chased those who were ahead and caught it with them. It was a good day at the end. I was third and I was still in the fight. From this stage, I learned that it doesn't matter to a stronger when you try something in life. The important thing is to get up in bed early and continue fighting for what you want. The second stage was within Sopan Guatavita and El Cisga. A stage with many ups and downs. Everything was going well. I was going with the group, but when it reached Batavita, it started to rain. This made the race a little bit difficult. It doesn't matter. The rain wasn't going to stop this challenge. We kept going before starting the last eight kilometers climb. Our friend got ahead of the chase group and began to go to a very high speed. I was behind him and thanks to his help, I couldn't save energy and covered me from the wind. With one kilometer to go, he runs up an energy and I kept going. I won my first stage. This put me in the first place of general classification. This day I learned the importance of teamwork to reach your goals. As the Chinese proverb says, if you're going to go if you go alone, you will go faster. But if you go accompanied, you go further. The third stage was the hardest of all. We had to climb 30 kilometers from Mesita del Colegio beyond the Salto del Tequendama. My strength is flat terrain, so it was a bird scar. Usually, in races of more than 25 kilometers uphill, I lost with my openings for 10 to 15 minutes. But in this case, I was faced in the race and could not get up. I was very afraid, but my competition for not that. So I decided to eat that fear and try to see myself uh, confident. The stage started and we started to climb very fast. The pace of the race was devastating and through my legs were very tiny, my mind have a fixed objective and no matter how it hurt, I had to keep going. Little by little, competitors began to left in the end and there were only four left. Only the last kilometers were missing, which were the hardest entire race. I was very tired, but I tried to hold and I finished fourth, losing only a few seconds. I was still first in the general classification and this lay I learned that a fundamental part of the achieving any challenge is showing a good attitude and belief in yourself. So always believe in yourself. All in all, it was the last stage of the race. I was in first place, 35 seconds ahead of the second. The last 
test consists on an individual time trial of 20 kilometers with 5 kilometers climb. This time there were no people who put me off wind or attack me. At this stage I had to complete only with myself. I started my time trial and it felt pretty good. However, I had many things on my mind. The first time I rode a bike with my dad, the first bike I had, the first time I cycled to the university, the times I arrived tired of training at home, the advice of my friends and strange gave me to improve my technique on the bike and I found that mirroring a challenge is the sum of small tips and actions that make you achieve your goal. In the end, I finished this time trial first and I was able to win the race with a little over of 39 seconds of advantage. I was very afraid to compete in this race. However, I found that many first were mental barriers and in the end, I was not competing against others. I was competing against myself.